first favourite of um, the five principles is the first one, um, assume capacity, because I think that reminds practitioners that um, they need to assume capacity and the person they're assessing doesn't need to prove anything. It's up to them to find the evidence if they think they lack capacity. So it's a very empowering uh, principle. It, it was called, I think at one point it was going to be called the Mental Incapacity Act and they changed the name. And so it applies to everybody. So that's one thing. It applies to everybody. And the principle of assuming capacity is extremely important because it places an emphasis on professionals, everybody in fact, to assume the person is able to um, articulate and engage with life as it is and make important decisions for themselves. And where there are concerns, then we need to support people to make those decisions. I mean, that is, that kind of, that is one of the things I take heart in. Uh, as, a, as an advocate, but actually just as a person, you know, who lives in the society, that that's the way I want to be treated. Um, so I think that's certainly one of the things I think everybody needs to know.